This month, to celebrate the release of Paranorman On Demand, we're focusing on small town stories with films in which local folks pull together to beat the odds in a collection we're calling Hometown Heroes. In Paranorman, new this month, Norman and his gang of friends from the town of Blythe Hollow take on zombies, ghosts, and a century-old curse in this eerily fun stop-motion adventure from the makers of Coraline. Paranorman is the story of this boy, Norman Babcock, who can see and talk to dead people. Hey, peace, man. But this makes him like very different, you know? And, and all the people in his town think he's just weird. I keep telling you, Neil, I, I like to be alone. So do I. Let's do it together. Return. Linda Cardellini is a war-torn veteran who must face new, unexpected battles when she returns home to tough times in her small town in Liza Johnson's poignant American drama. She is responding to the world that she returns to, you know, and there are problems there and there isn't enough meaningful work and there are you know, a lot of difficulties there. You quit your job? Yeah, it's not my fault. How is it not your fault? It just doesn't mean anything, you know? It doesn't matter. It doesn't matter? Hot Fuzz. Simon Pegg and Nick Frost team up as Take No Prisoners Cops, out to save a quiet English village from itself in Edgar Wright's hilarious assault on the action genre. We're bringing a level of carnage and excitement and action to locations that have previously not seen such things. How's it looked? Uh, he's in the freezer. Did you say cool off? No, I didn't say anything, actually. It's a shame. There was a bit earlier on that you missed when uh, I distracted him with the cuddly monkey, and then I, I said, playtime's over, and I hit him with the peace lily. In Billy Elliot, Jamie Bell excels as a local boy whose desire to dance ultimately moves even his town's toughest coal miners in Stephen Daldry's heartwarming tale. I think that it's very easy for anyone to identify with a story of struggle of any individual, in this case a, a young child. No child can succeed without the 100% support of the family. You are completely behind, Billy. Are you not? Yes. Yes, of course. Brick. High school meets hard-boiled in a small California town as Joseph Gordon-Levitt plays a teen detective oh, yeah? determined to solve the murder of his ex-girlfriend in Ryan Johnson's quick-witted mystery yarn. I didn't shake up the party to get your attention, and I'm not healing you to hook you. Your connections could help me, but the bad baggage they bring and make it zero-sum gain or even hurt me. Bombay Beach, Alma Harrell's poetic documentary captures the remarkable residents who have carved out a community in an abandoned California town, perched at the very edge of the world. What's this, Mommy? A bullet. Oh, that's a bullet. Can I see it? Can I have it? Throw that over there, okay? Can I throw it in the water? No. Coraline, a young girl whose family has moved to a new town, uncovers undreamt of possibilities Ooh. when she wanders into a mirrored other world in Henry Selleck's fantastic stop-motion fable. Initially, everything seems like it's a much more interesting, a much more cool place. And then she realizes that the other mother wants to keep her, and that's where the trouble starts. I want to be with my real mom and dad. I want you to let me go. Is that any way to talk to your mother? And this December, Bill Murray is FDR, changing the world from his upstate small town refuge in Hyde Park on Hudson. We think they see all our flaws, but that's not what they're looking to find when they look to us. And Matt Damon and John Krasinski star in Gus Van Sant's powerful new drama set in Heartland America, Promised Land. The town is gonna put it to a vote in three weeks. What the hell happened? You were supposed to get in, get out. Steven and I can handle this, sir. Big adventures with hometown heroes. From Focus Features, on demand this month. Once upon a time.